Okay, so, uh, in m my last video, um, I told you guys about, um, something knocking on the window at, like, 11 o'clock at night, um, the other night, and that's one of the reasons why we got Doggy here, and, um, whatever it was had knocked on this window. And that's what we heard Monday night. Well, last night, Shelly called me and told me she heard something knock on this even more forcefully. And that he didn't bark or anything. Well, well I'm not even going to show where my camera's at. But let's just say there's a camera on... Let's just say there's a camera on, uh, on that spot. And... I'm about to find out what it caught on camera. Well, it's not directly on it, but uh, it's enough that you can see where the dog is at here. Anything that would have crossed that area to get to the back of the camper. So, I'm going to turn this off and I'll turn it back on and I'll figure out what it is. Uh, so mystery's not solved. It didn't catch anything. This is on military time, but this is uh, me coming home at uh, 7-12. I've got the wrong... No, it's 2018. I've got it right. Um, that's me coming home and untangling a dog. The one before that, that's just before I went to work, I believe. 2015, whatever 2015 is, military time, that should have been. I don't know, that doesn't make any sense, really, because I, went, I left for work. I don't know, but that's the last video. And that just showed me. There's me during the day. It's 1611, whatever the hell that is. That's all me yesterday during the day. So it didn't catch anything at night. Huh. Wait, wait, wait. What are we calling this? Quail Dang. aviary. Hey, what? Okay, go ahead. We're building a quail aviary. 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 <laughs> We're building a quail uh, cave. <laughs> Out of pallets. This is a pallet project. <laughs> you sure you want me Where? filming this? Huh? You sure you, you want me filming this? It's not every day you build a quail aviary. Aviary? Aviary. aviary. I can't say that. <laughs> you want me to lift this up? Quail home. I'm still starting. Oh, pushing it out. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see what you meant. I see why you're going under the Yeah, it's too thick. Maybe what I might do is, you know, like you said, I'm going to knock that out. But I think I'm going to put boards across oh, yeah, here if necessary. Okay. Does this have a zoom? Um, not while it's on video. Oh, okay. So you just kind of have to walk it in like when... <laughs> that's, a, that's heavy now, dude. Pick that up. We're attached to two other ones. That kind of got heavy. That's going to be really nice when you guys get it done. There we go. Huh? That's going to be really nice when you guys get it done. Yeah, we can stop. 
I hate messing with them. I bang my thumbs almost every single time. Here are the birds that are be going that are going to be going into that cage that the Her or that Darren and Harold are building. Ten of them will be. These are quail. We're going to raise them for eggs, and um, some of them won't lay eggs, so they'll probably be uh, for meat. Shorter the other way because you set this inside of these. Okay, so we're flipping it. Yeah, we're just gonna put these in there. Okay. See what I mean? I'm going to go all the way to the edges now. 
Okay, four by four is going to fit on the inside too if that's important to you. But then, yeah, no, I don't think it will. I don't want to go work and then, then we'll go pick up like this and you reach in there and get your eggs and whatnot like that. Only side. That's cool. You won't be able to get them in the middle very easily. You don't have to climb in there. So we're, here's the cross. That's going to be a pretty big gap for me to have two rolls of. Now. We was doing yoga earlier, man. Yoga? Yes. That hurt, man. Full blind hippies. You have you got to wear a dress. <laughs> yeah. What'd you say? What'd you say? What? What'd you say? You gonna, gonna turn you into a yogi master. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hey, I shaved the other day. I said, not a hippie then. I said, that doesn't mean I have to be a No, a couple of days ago I did. I had a lot. Yep. It's all good, though. We like hippies. They're fun. Cut these right there. We'll probably have to put another two by four in the middle. I wouldn't run two rolls of chicken wire down the center. You'll be able to lift up your top. Yeah, Instead of putting a two by four straight down the center, and we'll put two two shorter ones. Wouldn't I mean it wouldn't be just less two by four to use. It's not just one long or two shorter. It's probably the same distance. That's probably three feet. So I just put them in there. And we'll cut these right here. Just screw those down. We put the hinges on these, so they'll pick up. We'll chicken wire those. Which I need to find another pair of hinges. And then. Yeah, that's gonna be nice. That's gonna be cool. Yeah. There's some Pretty strong nail there. Yeah. That was going to come apart with that. Not without one of these, yeah. Yeah. I did pretty good yesterday morning, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I had to go there, didn't I? <laughs> it's your own fault. Cow! <laughs> <laughs> you don't need that one, do you? Come on. <laughs> yeah, I almost lost that one. Too. Yeah, I'm going to check for these nails down here beside me, too. <clears throat> Parks, so that's going to mess those out. Just get two out of here. 
this in? I just knocked it. Yeah, just, just knock the oh, I got, nails I down. I, got, down. I think we are going to have to put a couple boards across here to stabilize this chicken wire, too. What is it? Tape measure. There's a tape. Yeah. Yeah, I got one of those. Where's that? You gonna have to get a new one, man. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's So here's the uh, quail avery, made mostly from pallets. I got ten quail. Here they are. Harold helped me build this. He built most of it, really. Uh, I guess still gotta pick some little shelter thing out of one of these totes and cut a cut holes in, flip it upside down. I still got a little bit of stapling probably to do. I think she might like to eat them. Yeah, I'm gonna get this finished up. Been up all night and all day. I'm working on a few projects. I'm really happy to get these quail to get started on the whole egg thing. He's probably, uh, I think he said about a month, month and a half or something like that. He's start hatching some eggs, I guess. See how this goes. The quail project, the homestead quail project.